Lichtenberg traces are an interesting scientific phenomenon that allows us to observe a lightning strike in progress. We've decided to capture our own lightning in wood, since wood makes for a great insulator which tremendously slows down the process. We're going to need a source of high voltage, some baking soda, clear tap water, and a wooden board with two attached electrodes. After adding several teaspoons of baking soda to the water to increase its conductivity, we are almost ready to begin our experiment. Don't forget to stir. The last thing we have to do is moisturize the wooden board using the mixture we have just prepared. And all that remains is putting on the electrodes and flipping the switch. Wood is made from cellulose, specifically cellulose fibers. These aren't particularly conductive by themselves, which is why we moisten them with the mixture beforehand. When introduced to our higher voltage, the cellulose starts burning away, leaving behind pure carbon, which is an excellent conducting material. The glowing lines show the paths through which is the current traveling most. And of course, once the paths join, we essentially create a short circuit, leaving the current only one possible path to travel along. Once this part of the experiment is complete, all that remains is to take a scrubbing brush and scrub off all the remaining soot to achieve the most decorative result. As is in nature, no two lightning strikes are exactly the same, meaning we can achieve different results every time we try the experiment. The board can of course be framed, cleaned and I must say, it makes for a killer decoration.